I got one. Well, it's all kind of fish in Louisiana. We catch, we catch flounder, we catch drum, we catch speckled trout, which is a big favorite. But they ain't nothing like the redfish because people love to catch a big fish, a big strong fish, and it, it just takes that drag out. People just love that. And then there's so many ways you could cook that and eat it. It's black and it's grilled. It. You can make cool bouillon, and it's just a delicious fish. You could you could uh, barbecue it. Anything you want with that fish is good. To, it's good eating fish. Prep Creole, Prep Soup, Fried Shrimp, Prep Etouffee, Prep Fried Rice, Pickled Shrimp, Prep Kebab. We're going to fish Carolina style. There's, there's a deep hole right up in here that passes through here, and there's some big drum in there. We just put a, a three-quarter ounce weight on there and to hook a piece of crab on there. We got this light tackle, and it, they'll give you a real good fight. It's going to stretch these lines. But up in here, it's about 30 foot deep, and where we at here, maybe about three or four, five, maybe six feet deep in there. And they'll hang up in these in this hole, and then sometimes they really pile up in there. And every now and then, you catch uh, you catch one maybe six, seven pounds, eight pounds, but most of them about 35, 40 pounds. 35 pounds? 35 pounds, 35 pound bow drum. Just cast right in the front of the boat, about straight in the front of the boat, but that, that's a hole out there with a current swirling. Perfect, you got All right. it. When you hook them, you know you got a big monster. It feels like a Volkswagen pulling against you. And sometimes they really tag it hard. All right, hey, hey, hey. all right. Yes, sir. All right. Look at that! Give me five minutes, buddy. Yeah! Look yeah, at that! go! <laughs> All right! We started using these red eagle claw hooks. They're very sharp and very strong, and it, 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 there's some extra bobs on there that we, we, we could hook the crabs on it and it stays on longer. They, most of the time they hook right in their right mouth, which is good for the fish because they live, they, they don't die from being hooked way deep. And it, uh, it's a very, very strong hook, and we, it does a good job for us. No tears, no fears, we'll be together. Again. Now this is not brackish water, is it? Yeah, this is, you catch anything in here. You catch bass, redfish, speckled trout, flounder. You can, uh, well, what what are we going to be catching today? I don't know what we're going to be catching. We're just going to go try it out and see. No, you got to have a plan. Seriously, you don't know what we're going to catch. Well, we're going to catch some redfish. Is that the poncho guarantee? Yeah, that's the guarantee. We're going to get them. Have they been, good. seriously, have they been coming up a lot? Yeah, they've been coming up after shad and, uh, and uh, a little mullet. And they look like they're pretty hungry right now. They, they'll bust on top of that water. This is the perfect time of year and the perfect conditions, isn't it? If you got wind the waves, you can't see the, uh, you can't see the red fish. The name of the game, it seems like, when the weather's like this and the wind is calm, is just to keep traveling, looking. Look, look for bait, look for birds. Look for the bait and the birds and they're on top of the water at school. And if we see a school, we're going to bust that to them. Good trout. Got him? Got him. Big fat one like me. <laughs> Ooh. Whoa! Big poncho. Big chunky one. Yes, sir, buddy. Yeah. Look at that. He ate that plastic, didn't he? He, he oh, uh oh. He swallowed that. He liked it. He's gonna bite my finger off. Oh, that's a big boy there. Huh? Look at yes, that. Yes, sir. It that's is. a monster. That'll make a sandwich. Big yellow mouth. Oh, we hit all kind of people. We hit them from all over the whole United States and even from out the country. And, and uh, we will take them by the camp and show them what we got. And, and they just, it's so attractive to camp. It's a good 
beautiful place. It's out in the wilderness. You only can get to it by boat or by seaplane. And people like that. And we're out there, and it's, we're right on the fishing. And I got the good Cajun food out there. And people just love that. I like all the fish, but they ain't nothing like that redfish. He's just, he's a predator, and he just comes at that, at that bait. You can catch them on top water, and they fighting and pulling all the time fighting and the people just enjoy fighting those fish they they sometimes they're jumping on top of the water and oh it's just great fish to latch onto on a small reel when you hook onto those things the drag just goes out of that line oh man they just, they're just so powerful 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 fish <laughs> look at that just look another big thing. old red fish we were so fortunate here that storm went over to the east and we were lucky to feel had never got no damage or nothing. We out fishing already. And uh, the fishing's been great. The first one passed and it blew all the water out, kind of purged it out. Then Rita came along and put all the water back in here. It was pretty bad for a little while with the, with the high tides and all. The fish, I don't know where these fish come from, but they, they packed up all over in there. Classify these as good times. Good times. Hey, yes. Good times are coming, humming. That is a nice one. Well, look at the colors on him, I'm pretty. Mm -hmm.